Would I take the Shivana? Let me think about it. If I play Shivana, oh, I actually think I would take it. I would play Shivana over like Bard Soraka or something. I mean, that's if I'm not dead here. These siphons are too smart. I'm dead. Goodbye world. Oh, it's not even close. All right. Guys, I did your science for you. I got the highest high roll of a start to Ezra Rural you've ever seen in your life. And it was not even close to doing well at all. There was like not a single round where I felt like I could have won after like stage three. And this was like best in slot trade sector. I almost naturaled Ezreal three by the end of stage two. Like I almost just got it for free. I hardly had to roll. And it's still like, there's no skill in this build. You literally just corner everything except for one unit in the front. And you just like hope to see them kill him. And it was not it. It was disgustingly weak. Holy shit, that was actually terrible. Even with like the best RNG, that build is trash. Hello, Cole, Nicolas. The only one star carry I can, or the one cost carry I can think of that's still decent is probably set. All right, I've decided I'm going to simply hit. That's right. I'm going to simply just hit next round and I'm going to get my LP back. 600 LP, easy clap. Ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to do something extremely, extremely woke. After bouncing up and down, wait, one trick? This game says I'm a one trick. Wait, I am absolutely not a one trick. Wait, let's search my lol chest. There's no way I'm, I'm a, I'm a, there's no way I'm a one trick. Let's take a look. Let's see, I played. Oh, it thinks I'm a one trick because I play Lulu every single game. It knows I'm addicted to the Lulu see. No, it's not even being a one trick. Lu the Lou Lussie is just the sweetest nectar like that exists on the earth. She's just the best unit in the game. Like that's all there is to it. Oh wow, this is a bad too. One, two, three, four, five, six. Easiest 10 gold of my life. And imagine I get a cane. Dude! Oh, hello, one sweet pea. When I was younger, I think I was 10 years old when I heard this song for the first time. I thought this song was so cool. And I specifically, I went to all my friends. I was like, dude, I just found this awesome song sung by Kane West. <laughs> I'm like, I'm like nine years old. Kane West, baby! Okay, Celestial Blessing is not terrible. Cannoneer Heart is also honestly not terrible. If I'm down to just like kind of force it. I could also reroll. Rerolling a Silver feels kind of awkward. It's either force Cannoneers. No, I'm gonna reroll into Greatness. Shimmer Scale Crest. Wait, oh, but there's AFK. No, some things are more important than going AFK. Some things are more important. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. The fact that it's Mogul Mail is extremely unlucky. Mogul Mail is like the by far the worst item you could get early game. Mogul Mail is actually the worst item you get early game. It's just you'll never trigger it. No unit can survive 40 hits early game unless you have like a War Mogs. Hello, Phoenix. Oh, Shimmer Swain, though. I could build a lock right now, but I'm pretty sure it's uh, Rod on Swain. Okay, let's do this for now. Okay, I've decided to psycho level. If I want to trigger this Mogul Mail, wait. How the fuck do you have four two stars? Uh, three two stars. Uh-oh. I just leveled to five and I'm about to lose. And even worse, I'm about to not trigger my mogul mail. I'm about to not trigger my mogul mail. Oh god, wait, I might win. Wait, Rod on Swain. 
They call this the rod on Swain death. Rod on Swain death. Mogomel is actually so useless. Yeah, let me get a level five Edos. Come on. Come on. Come on, Aatrox. Just get beat up 40 times. That's it. That's all I'm asking for. I have a 1% chance to win this round. Oh my god, when Shen ults, it doesn't count as stacks. This thing is actually impossible to trigger. What? Wait, guys, do you see this? My cane is backdooring the Senna. Wait, my, the Senna heal to full. Oh, because of fucking Thrill of the Hunt. Bro! I'm so upset. I can never trigger this goddamn mogul mail. Okay, I think I figured it out. More important than the Swain item is the mogul mail item. The item that allows me to trigger the item and get two gold every round. A gargoyle stone plate. Okay, two star Aatrox, gargoyle stone plate. Surely this will trigger the goddamn item, right? Give me Aatrox, A. Okay. Surely, surely this will trigger the item. Why didn't you go belt for Sunfire? Because I need the most pure tank item possible to make sure I can live for 40 hits. It's it's two gold, that's a lot. That's a lot, that's like 30% of how much gold I get per round. Come on, surely, surely it pays off this time. Aatrox cast your ability one more time. Yes! I got two gold, baby! The game's over! Okay, good loss. Alright, would you guys believe me if I told you level 5 Eidos is coming? I wouldn't believe me either. Alright. What do you expect from the mid set? I expect them to remove Astral's from the game. I expect for them to hopefully introduce a new dragon that interacts with the game in an interesting way. I'm not a fan of dragons, but if they're gonna commit to it, at least like make it something kind of interesting, you know what I mean? Something like a, a support dragon, that'd be cool. And then also I demand, and I will not settle on this, a pool party trait where they're all hot babes and graves and Garen. What about Jarvan? I don't find Jarvan particularly sexy, unlike graves and Garen. Oh, dude, I would pog if they brought Riven back. You know what they should have done instead of dragons? Like, instead of making these units that like aren't even real units, like green Galio, <laughs> blue Galio, <laughs> blue Shivana. If they just did, did like, oh yeah, these are like the elites or like the legends of the of the set. That would have been pretty cool. If there was just like five units that were just like the bosses of the of the set and they, would, they just knew them as like the cool units, that'd probably be much more enjoyable. Oh wow, I have my choice of... They did? No, dude, like nobody gives a shit about Green Galio. Or blue Shivana. No one gives a shit about those units, right? I'd rather it just be like, oh yeah, Darius is the boss, right? Darius is one of the five elites, and Darius takes up two slots, and he's incredibly powerful. Basically like Colossus, but more interesting. I 
I feel like that would have been way more interesting of a catch than like just playing dragons for the sake of playing dragons. Ooh. Tiny Titans might be good if I'm going Shimmer Skill. Second win is guaranteed value. Tiny Titans is kind of interesting. Hmm. I actually think I'm strong enough to win streaks. So I'll take second wind. All right. I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to roll here. I've got a lot of pairs. Did someone say level up and roll for EDOS? Yeah, I'm down. I don't know who said it, but I'm down. Ah. Thank you for that advice, whoever that was. I don't know who said it, but thank you. Thank you very much. I need to put in Kane for seven shimmer. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Oh man, if only I was a little bit faster. I didn't realize I had six shimmer in. Gold Mancers? Bruh. Bruh, Gold Mancer stuff. Oh my god, I'm about to farm one million. One million what? One million pogs! Holy shit, I'm gonna get so much money. Draven's X, this is better than Draven's X. It actually makes Swain stronger and he farms so much money. Like this will farm more money than Draven's X, I promise you. Draven's Axe is eight gold like every three rounds and a component. This one is like 10 gold per round if you do it correctly. So if we get two star Swain with like a decent item. Also the rest of my board is so weak, Swain's gonna get every single kill. So every time I win a round, odds are Swain's gonna have farmed like eight gold. I just got six gold already. Okay, bow will work, rod will work. I think rod is a little bit better. I think archangels makes makes more sense. Okay, let's go tank item then. I took belt instead of chain. Uh, this is because warmogs is good. I don't really need another gargoyle, and I could use a, a random Zeke's. All right, we're just chilling. I could roll just to like hit some two stars, but I don't think we need to. If I had pairs, I would. Okay, this is sick. Just keep everything the same. I'm really sorry, Set. I'm really doing you dirty by just leaving you out here to die. But I promise you, it's for the good of our board. I promise you, it'll pay off in the long run. This Swain almost got one shot. Wait, what the hell? My Swain almost just got one shot. He's gonna heal back up to full, right? Okay. Oh my God. Six gold already. So much money. So much money. This game's over. This is a first place. This game's a first. Another pair. Okay, I'm not kidding. It might actually be the right play to just low, uh, to not level and just roll a little bit. Okay, I'm gonna roll 10 gold. Just cause like the odds of me hitting something is pretty high. Nice. Actually, I probably should have kept Braum. Braum was my next in. Yeah, Braum was my next in, so I should have kept him. That's eh, fine. Box box, remember to throw in random champion and item names for your editors if, in case this game goes on YouTube. Uh, this game is definitely not going on YouTube. I've gotten Zoe 3 like 12 times in the last two weeks. I guarantee you my editors are gonna look at this footage and gonna be like, are you serious? Bro, really? A another Zoe 3 game? Please be more original. Oh yeah. Shimmer skill, Swain into early EDOS. Yep, 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 been there, done that. I promise you they are not impressed. They're just like, are you serious? You're seriously doing this again? They're just like, come on, man. 
<laughs> no more Zoe 3. That's why I'm gonna go for Yasuo 3. Oh wait, we actually got a Yasuo 3 game earlier. Oh, we actually got a Yasuo 3 game. Oh fuck. What, what other tuber ideas are left? Oh, Bard 3. Yeah, 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 we gotta go for Bard 3. I uh, I definitely need to build a Sunfire. I guess Volibear can have it. Actually. There you go. This works out pretty well. Oh, Benjamin Liu. All right, is there any chance I get a spat here? Oh shit! Surely that's still gonna trigger, right? <laughs> Wait, it might actually. No! One second off! Shimmer? No. Damn it! There's no way I can get another Shimmer Crest. I mean, you could maybe go Salvage Bin and later on get a spat of some sort, but that, that's gonna be so long until it works. I mean, like, Cybernetic is like, it's really good in general. Fuck, dude. Okay, we'll just win the game. Smoge! Dude, what's the point if you're not gonna just, like, win the game? All right, sorry, what's the point of getting first place if you're not gonna get like a three-star legendary in the process? Hello, Scruffer Nutter. Also, I would like to remind the world that I am playing the game with a one-star Swain. Yes, I am playing the game with a one-star Swain. Wait, I could go nine. <laughs> I could go nine. No, I'm supposed to roll. I'm supposed to roll for at least a two star slain. Zoe? I could actually go nine. All right, I'm gonna roll a little bit. It shouldn't be that hard to hit a slain. Oh, wait. Would I ever play Zaya? Oh, we'll get him. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Swain is actually better. Swain 2 would be better than Zai 2, but... Hmm. What if I just never hit the Swain 2? This is a Shivana. Oh, shit. This is a Shivana. Oh, shit! Wait. Wait a second. Is my one-star Swain... Winning. My one star Swain won! Giga Chad. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay. One star Swain versus Shivana 2. One star Swain, one star Edos. Guys, I had a wonderful idea. I had an absolutely splendid idea. What do you say we take this sword and I just reroll 100 gold on Treasure Dragon until I get a spat? Oh my god. Is this the fastest nine you've ever seen in your life? Fight or make room for those who will. When going gets up, you call Oh, early bard. Early bard is huge. Early bard, okay. Okay, 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 huge. I'm still rocking a one star Swain. Just so everyone knows. <laughs> 
Still rocking the one star swain. Okay, I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to sell this swain. Okay, and then we can play Hecarim soon. Get out a Shimmer Scale. Uh, if I hit... If I hit a Shivana, I might actually. I think we're just like looking for a three-star uh, Zaya at this point. I cannot believe I hit five Zayas and zero Soyans in the mid-game. Hello, Noshi. Okay, this Zaya is actually working quite well. Okay, Yasuo just one-shot the guy from really far away. Okay, if I get a spat here, the game is over. But the odds, the odds, the odds of getting a spat on this carousel, it's 1% per roll. It's 1% per roll. So like, I don't expect it. If I get something decent, I'll just take it. Now we can do better. Spat. Now we can do better. Spat. Now we can do better. Spat. Okay, this one is insanely good. Sorry guys. I know you want to see the spat. I know you want to see the spat, but I definitely just want to get first place. Oh, hello, Emily Wang. Right, it's definitely just like giant slayer on Zaya. And then Warmogs, Hodge. Yeah, I'm sorry guys. I know it's a little boring. Thank you, Emily Wang, for the raid. I hope you had I hope you had a wonderful stream. Actually wait. I should give the there we go. It makes sense to give the gem to Zoe. Wait, everyone's going to bedge? Are, are you going to bedge because I didn't reroll 100 gold looking for one spat and instead took a free win? Oh, how did Emily Wang do? All right, everyone's going to bed because I didn't throw the game for their entertainment. Guys, I want to hit 1000 LP. Oh, she made it today too? Pog. Bedge time. Wait, why is she going to bed now? It's 6 p.m. Oh, right. I remember, like, I was playing video games with her last night, and then she was like, oh, yeah, I just woke up. <laughs> it was like 11 p.m. Oh, look at this money. Oh. Wait, this, this Zaya is actually litty titty. Oh? Okay, I might... Oh, whoa. Wait, I'm not even kidding. I could probably hit a three-star Zaya right now. I'm gonna roll a little bit, and if I hit one more Zaya, I'm going for it. Oh, a Shivana? Okay, 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 okay. It's definitely like a Zaya three with like six Rage Wings. I'll play the Shimmer skills for a little bit longer. But yeah, eventually the Goldmancer staff's gotta go. And the, hi, I'm Zoe! Let's fucking go, Zaya. You're still alive. Nine HP, gig oh, she's dead. Okay, it's fine, because Yasuo does the thing. Yasuo's gonna do the thing, right? He's gonna do the thing, right? Right? <laughs> Okay, wait, this motherfucker is griefing my Zaya 3! Oh, no, you don't. All right, all right, after this round, I'm down to make the pivot. Okay, so let's do some math. Uh, we're gonna sell Edos. We're gonna sell Edos for Shivana. Nico, Swain, Nar, Soraka can go in. Yeah, we can sell the Shimmer Scales, okay. All right, we definitely can probably get a three-star Zaya. I have a lot of money. Also, I, I've had a bard farming dudes this whole game. Look at my, my legendary odds, it's 19%. Wait, maybe we can hit three-star Shivana. Maybe we can hit three-star Shivana. Oh my God, wait, I might, I might be pause champing. Yeah, it's, it's kind of pause champ. 
Oh wait, the other guy's a two-star Shivana. Oh fuck, you're right. Can't hit. All right, all right, all right, all right it's fine. Let's do the roll down. Wow, I really hit this first. all the items on Shivana, huh? I was like, maybe I should wait so I can give her some damage items. But like, am I really gonna get three items? Am I really gonna get three items for Shivana? I should just give some of the tank items to her. Oh my god, I lost. Box box, you missed the Warmogs? Wait, I put... Wait, what the fuck? I put the Warmogs on Yasuo? How? How? Oh, he dashed through. Can someone give me a replay of that? I want to see that for myself. He dashed into the item. I was like, yoink. Are you serious? Honestly, maybe I should forge all Yasuo item. I kind of wanted to reforge um, the Shimmer Spat, though. Reforge the Shimmer Spat into like... Something potentially good like Jade. Remake him. Uh, I don't know. I don't have a two-star Yasuo. I might be down to remake him. Yeah, I'm down to remake him. I'm pretty confident that I'll hit a two-star Yasuo. Like, I've got 20% odds for legendaries right now. All right, you guys ready? It's Zaya three time. Give me something good. Oh, blue buff Mirage Spat! What's the Mirage? Spell Sword? I uh, I guess that goes on Soraka. Why not Shivana? I don't think Shivana's autoing enough for that. Need a Nar. Oh, thank you for linking me. I'm matized. Okay, I gotta roll. Man, did I really just like bench a, a bard? Did I really just bench a bard? <laughs> it's probably for the best. It's either bard, no, it's gotta be. Everyone else is like pretty important here. All right, can I get an X in the chat? One Zaya, the game's over. Oh. Wait. Before I do that. <laughs> I'm about to ruin your day. <laughs> we don't even need. Wait, I literally got the last Zaya. Literally, the other guy had three. All right, show me what you got, Zaya. All right, just in case this game goes on to YouTube, I realized with all my editors, every single time I say anything that exists in the game, like Hand of Justice, they make a graphic appear. 
They make a graphic appear on the screen so that new viewers know exactly what we're talking about and they have context. It's honestly very nice of them to do that. They don't have to, but they do it anyway because they care about the viewers. But if I were to randomly start spewing out <clears throat> an egregiously large amount of different things that exist in TFT, what would that do to the overlay on screen on the YouTube video? If I were to just randomly start saying stuff like, uh, <clears throat> Zaya 3, Hand of Justice, Frozen Heart, Titans Resolve, Gargoyle Stoneflake, Yasuo, Nico, Nico, Two Star Nico, Nar, Hecarim, Rage Wing, Swain, Dragomancer, Mort Dog. Oh, dude, if this goes on YouTube, I'm so excited for what's gonna appear on the screen. My editors are gonna quit the job. <laughs> box Box, we quit. Alright, guys, does this game cap out at Zaya 3? Is there something better I can do? Wait, am I gonna lose? Is Yasuo gonna do the thing? Maybe Yasuo does the thing here? One shots the dragon? We should try for something great. Don't you guys agree? We should... Why settle for Zaya 3? Never settle. You can do better than that. Never settle. We are going to go for something that has historically never been done before in the history of TFT. Are you guys ready for this? That's right. It's a Swain 2. Wait, you have my Edge of Night. Fuck. Oh yeah, I needed that for Yasuo. Holy eat us. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, welcome back, Swain1. Why didn't you go for Bard 3? I, I, I tried for everything 3-star, but I didn't have the money for it. Box Box, your Zaya 3 only has two items. You know that, right? Oh, yeah, no. You're wondering, like, why did I not give the Edge of Night to Zaya, my 3-star Giga Chad 1 uh, solo carry? I mean, the answer is really simple, right? It's because I only has two hands, right? In the left hand, she holds the Giant Slayer. In the right hand, she holds the Rage Plate. Where could the Edge of Night possibly go? Anyway, you guys want to see, um... There's a Sorka player alive. You guys want to see a casual Hecarim 3? You have now reached 300 flush today. You guys want to see a Hecarim 3? A casual little eight second stun that deals a thousand magic damage. Here we go. Everything dies in one Xyle. Nice game. Dude, this is the early Shimmer Scale Crest game. Holy shit, this is why I always, I always go Shimmer Scale every single game. This only happens like one out of 10 Shimmer Scale games, but holy shit, is it worth it. What is Yasuo doing? A shroud? Okay, as if the game wasn't over enough. Oh yeah! Does Zaya look cute in a shroud? Be honest with me, guys. Oh! Oh my god! Wait, guys! Guys! Pause, champ! We might actually hit Swain too. Oh! Oh my god. No one has ever hit that unit before in the history of TFT on live television. All right, here you go, Zaya. Oh, yeah, yeah. Looking cute in that shroud. Actually, she's basically wearing a shroud. You know what's funny? I could win trade. If I like, if one of these guys was my friend, I could like throw my Zaya into the middle for one round. I could literally decide who gets first, who gets second place this game. But, I don't know any of these guys, so fuck them all indiscriminately. Yeah, best in slot Zaya. Giant Slayer, Gwinsu's, Shroud. He's dead! Minus 29.
Oh, even my clone's gonna kill him. It's a double kill. Is this guy going minus 21? Let's see. Minus 20 versus minus 21. Holy shit. The battle for second place. Yeah, Pog. I always hear Pog. I really hope this one goes on YouTube. Just nothing that special happened. We've done Zaya 3 before. We've done Hecarim 3. But have you ever done them in the same game? I hope this one goes on the tube. That way, I, I really want to see what those those edits look like on the on the big screen. Yeah, my editors are going to quit when they see this one.